Hello, today I'm going to show you how to find your Amazon Seller ID and MWS Auth token, which are necessary to integrate your Amazon account into the Shipping Easy application. Please make sure you have annotations turned on in YouTube using the gear icon in the bottom right. The first step is to go to the Amazon Marketplace Web Services sign up page. This page can be reached at developer.amazonservices.com. If your marketplace is for a different country, replace .com with whatever that country's domain abbreviation is. CA for Canada, DE for Germany, etc. On the right side of the screen, click the yellow button that says Sign Up for MWS. Uh, you may need to sign into your Amazon Seller account. If you're already signed in, check up top to make sure it's the correct account. If you're not confident, log out and log in again to the correct account. Uh, on this screen, select the button that says, I want to use an application to access my seller account with MWS. In the application name field, enter Shipping Easy. Now, the developer account number is different depending on which country your marketplace is. We have two developer numbers. You can find them both in the comments of this video, as well as the article from our help site linked on your screen right now. Since this is my U.S. store, I'm going to enter the developer number that applies to U.S., Canada, and Mexico marketplaces. 9250-5860-2418. I hit Next. Then I agree to the Amazon MWS license agreements and give Shipping Easy permission to access my account. Click Next once more and I've got my seller ID and my auth token. Then I just copy and paste these into Shipping Easy where it's asked for it. Click Save. And if I have more than one marketplace, it's going to have me select the marketplace associated. In this case, it's going to be United States. I hit Save. And my Amazon store is successfully integrated. Uh, you'll go through your store settings and make sure everything is set up how you want it to be. Uh, the video linked on your screen right now goes through the store settings one by one, um, but once you've got it set up, you hit save, and the integration is complete. Your Amazon orders pull over automatically, and we communicate back to Amazon. How easy.